Oh, on the knees too. I thought this, I thought this movie was for kids. <laughs> All right, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be watching Jumanji, Welcome to the Jungle. Now, you might be wondering, where's the first movie? Why are we starting with the second? And that's because I have seen the first one. I have seen the first one a lot. I have seen it. I watched it so much throughout my childhood. It was whenever my parents needed me to just sit in one spot, they just played the first Jumanji. They're like, here you go, go crazy. So I am pretty familiar with that movie. Now, it has been a while since last time I've seen it. I was probably nine or 10 last time I like actually watched it. So it's been 13, 14 years since I've seen it, but can't recall much from it now. I already know if I were to rewatch it, I would start to remember what's happening as we're watching it. Like I would get reminded of like, oh yeah, this is about to happen. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But I actually do know about somebody who's not on the poster of this movie that's in it. They're a surprise appearance and it was spoiled for me in like a weird, in a weird way. So I'm gonna play a video for you, but for context, I was at this celebrity golf tournament in Tahoe two years ago, and I was taking a video of someone walking by, and just listen to the audio in this clip. That's how that got spoiled for me. So I do know that he's in this movie, which it would have been a cool surprise. But anyways, I'm gonna stop wasting time. We're just gonna hop right into this movie. If you'd like to watch the full length reaction, that will be available on Patreon, as well as early access to the next Jumanji movie will also be available on Patreon or YouTube membership. So click the join button down below. But anyways, let's get started. Board game. Who plays board games? Bro, that's not just any board game, dog. video game cartridge mode. All right, different, different. Hit slam, you're dead. Strike, strike, counter. Wait, this fool isn't hereditary. Spencer, <laughs> honey! Ah! Mom, what did we say about the knocking? I'm late for work. Yeah, he could have been rubbing one out. Oh, he, oh, I thought he was about to just rub one out. I was like, wait, why are you using hand sanitation? <laughs> Psycho? <laughs> Doesn't matter. <laughs> no, everything has to be symmetrical. <sighs> Why are you wearing a raincoat? What do you mean? <laughs> I mean, it's not raining. Oh. Yeah, it's not even bad well, weather. It might. I mean, you never... No, it's not. It's literally like 70 degrees outside. <laughs> like, it's not even cloudy. Again, but I was thinking this weekend. This weekend. Yeah, ah. Uh. Mm. Hey, you need a ride? I'm going with her. You know what? That's actually better for I don't blame you. It's not like I was your best friend for your entire childhood. That's fine. What'd you say? <gasps> Damn, were they? Who the hell? Okay, here's like the weird thing about the first, first movie. It's like, I've seen it a lot, but it's been so long since the last time I've seen it. I don't know if I'm gonna catch like any references back to the first movie, unless they're really obvious. But it's cute enough for me. Hey, there's some rando behind you. <laughs> Bethany, did you just make a call during the quiz? Yeah, but I finished my quiz already. Oh, okay. Well, have you noticed that other people haven't? So? Oh, I'm sorry. Let me back up. You're aware there are other people in the world, right? Wait, who is this? Who's the teacher? Her voice is so familiar. I, I've seen her in something else, I know it. Linda, I mean, she's supporting me as a woman and it feels like maybe you should too. What? Just hang up the phone. Okay, all right. Yeah. Bethany, hang it up now. Two minutes and we're done. And Dude, what is your problem, Bethany? Jesus, no self-awareness. So selfish, damn. You have to participate just like everybody else. Otherwise, why are you even here? It's a requirement. Yeah, it's PE. I have to be here. What do you mean? And, and I don't understand the obsession with throwing a ball into a hoop and, oh, touchdown, five points. Okay. Six points. A lot wrong with that, but yeah. First, that, that's what we're doing here? Fun? Mm. This is school. We are supposed to be learning things that actually matter. Bro, PE was late. She's tripping. She's tripping. PE was so fun. Dude, the best time in PE was when we did the um, the volleyball unit and the badminton unit. Oh my god, it was so bad for everyone. Our team ran through everyone. Tenth grade, fourth period, undefeated team. I didn't cheat. I... It was my fault. I made him do it. You made him have you write his 
paper. <laughs> yeah. He's trying to take the blame. He's trying to fall on the sword for him, but it's not believable at all. <laughs> okay, can today get any worse? Are you gonna help? Or are you too pretty? I'm too pretty. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I don't like either of them. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think it matters that much. Jefferson Seaplane McDonough, pilot and mm. rascal. Oh, yep. It's Nick Jonas right there. I'll be Shelly Oberon, the curvy genius. That's Jack Black. <laughs> Welcome to Jumanji. Unplug it! What's happening to your head? What's hands? wrong with you? I don't know. Damn, they got tossed. Who is she? Who are you guys? Huh? Okay, what the hell is going on? I'm Spencer. The hell you are? What is going on? Martha? You're Ruby Roundhouse. And Bethany. You're Professor Shelley Oberon. She did get Jack Black. That was pretty predictable. <gasps> no! <laughs> that allergy, Spencer? Huh? I don't have the top two feet of my body. Did yeah. I? It's funny because. Fridge was the big jock, and now he got the smallest body. It's the only explanation that oh. old game machine must get in all of us now. Oh fuck! Wait. So okay, he's dead. Wait, is he just respawn? Yeah, he's gonna. Yeah, he's just. He's just gonna respawn. Yeah, respawn. You do from the clutches of a warlord in the jungles of Peru. Mm. You've never left his side. Oh, the rolls have been flipped. Him to put it back, but once he had it in his grasp, he could never let it go. I waited till they. That doesn't seem right. <laughs> Right then, here you go. Oh, he just has it? Okay, shit. <laughs> ...to return the jewel to the Jaguar's eye and lift the curse. Mm. And I'm sure you'll want to get started right away. Okay. Anyway, Good luck. If you wish to leave the game, you must save Jumanji and call out mm. its name. Yeah, so we have no choice. <laughs> All right. ...piece of what? Cheerio! Well, you can't just give us a ride to the statue? And remember... <laughs> yeah, for real. It's not part of the game, though. <laughs> Oh my god, that must be what we're looking for, the missing piece of the map. But the problem is, there's nothing here. Oh, that's great. <laughs> what do you mean there's nothing there? It's a map, just like he said. Oh, only he can see it. Cartography. <gasps> oh! Wow. <laughs> Weakness is none. <laughs> Weakness. None? Watch, Kevin Hart's weakness is gonna be it's gonna be height or something like that. <laughs> I just, I, I think I just pressed my, my enormous left peck. Yeah, it's like the boob area. Let me show you. Get the hell away from me. <laughs> weakness cake, speed strength. Huh. Strength is my weakness. <laughs> How is strength my weakness? Because Kevin Hart's super feeble. <laughs> Well, I think it means you carry my weapons in your backpack and you give them to me when and if I need them. <laughs> He's your bitch. What does? It says the mighty roar. You just immediately started thinking of Katy Perry. From the deep. The hippo came from the deep. The deep. Shout out the deep. Right here, I think. Ooh, what the hell? Who the fuck is this? is this? Okay, is this an NPC or a playable character? Oh no, these are enemies. These are mercenaries. Damn. Oh shit. That was sick. My back. I would rather die. Jump on my back. Nope, I'm going down. If your character dies, then you're just gonna respawn. But do, wait, do we have like a certain amount of lives? I feel like that's very important information. Like, they got me. Oh, they got. Oh. You'll just respawn. Wait, what? What just happened to her? Is she gonna respawn right here or at the spawn point all the way back there? That's, that's very important. Or she's just gonna fall in the water behind him. What the hell is happening? Oh. That's what I thought. We each have oh, that's lives, what. Guys. Oh, okay, okay. These okay, little okay. tattoos on our arms. What happens if you die in the game, though? I guess since you're technically, like, in the game... What happens if we use up all our lives? Yeah. You die in real life? Well, usually that would mean... Game it's over. game over. Yeah. I've actually been stuck in one, okay? So I'm not certain, but yes, I'm afraid... We'll just, we'll just assume yes. We better find the missing piece, then. Uh, easy. You just, uh... You want zip? Take it out. Fire away. Martha! Come look at my penis! 
<laughs> well, is this the first that you've seen it? Yes, I didn't want to look. I looked at mine within the first 20 seconds of getting here. <laughs> I'm happy to report that I was able to bring one thing from the outside world. Oh my god. That's cat. Wow. Wow. Wow! Oh, this is so much easier! <laughs> <laughs> the fact that I'm not Instagramming this right now is insane. That'd be weird. It's a totally different experience for her, technically, so it's pretty mind blowing. I just think you live in like the hot popular girl bubble, you know, where everybody either treats you like a princess or like an object. Maybe it makes you a little self-absorbed. But do you think maybe the reason why you're so judgy is because you're like afraid that people aren't gonna like you, so you decide not to like them first? Yeah, that's fair too. Maybe. I'm just saying you're a babe. Own it. Thanks. I guess. Yeah, get your confidence up. All right, okay, I feel like we're getting some pretty good character development through both of them, so. They made them pretty unlikable in the beginning on purpose, so yeah. They're growing on me. They're growing on me. I think it's just Jack Black, though, and the actress playing Martha. So you pretended not to even know me anymore until you needed me to do your homework because you couldn't do it yourself. You know what? I'm not stupid, Spencer. I should kick the shit out of you right now. I'd like to see you try. What did you say? You're a muscle I'm supposed to be afraid of you? Is that what you think? Maybe. As long as we're in this game. Ain't nothing changed. Don't let this new body get your butt whooped. We get out of the game, he's beating your ass. Dumbass. Mm. Oh. Oh. oh! He's gonna respawn, but he just wasted a life. Chill out. He'll be back. Yeah, but that's a waste of a life. Why didn't he eat shit when he- Oh, I mean, that makes sense. He's like the Giga Chad, so of course he's gonna have a perfect landing. He's not gonna eat shit as he falls. <laughs> Damn, bro, that could have just killed him right there and wasted his life. I feel like when Kevin Hart dies, he he's gonna have a bunch of coins explode out of him like Sonic. <laughs> we have to do this together. Could you say that one more time, please? <laughs> just came. Get him a tissue right now. What? What is this? That's my famous pound cake. Cake? Oh, it's his weakness. Wait, well, what's gonna happen then? He's just gonna continuously eat, like... Yeah, no, 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 it's okay. It probably just meant that I love cake. I couldn't resist it. Yeah. Hey, no, it's all not... good. Oh! <laughs> just exploded. I was gonna say, something else is gonna happen. The shot's setting it up. I didn't expect him to explode. Ration! Get you better rest. shut your ass up! <laughs> Dr. Bravestone, thank goodness you're here. Jumanji needs you. Dr. Bravestone, thank goodness you're here. Jumanji needs you. Rude. Yeah, it's just a script. Find the missing piece. Hmm, he has to say it. He's the main character, so. Trust one another and never blink. The missing piece is not what you think. Is this like the sand castle in Minecraft? It's like a trap door and he fall on TNT or something. Ooh, just grab it by the neck and throw it. It's a black mamba. A quarter milligram of its venom is enough to kill an adult. You feel a tingling sensation in your mouth and extremities followed by a fever. Damn, well, since The Rock is the main character, he probably has like 20 health bars compared everyone else only probably has like five, so he could probably eat a bite from it. Snake, don't move. I think someone has to make direct eye contact and not blink. And then spend Alright, if it is that, let's see if I can do it. Who's good at staring and not blinking? I'll do, I'll go. I'll do it. I'm amazing at it. Then this is your mom. <laughs> That's a dick sucking go right there. Oh, on the knees too. I thought this, I thought this movie was for kids. <laughs> now. All right, I'm not gonna blink. I'm not gonna blink. I'm not gonna blink. Oh, that wasn't too hard. Ooh, yes, yeah, snatch that shit by the neck. What do we do? I think I'm out of blood. You gotta defang it. I gotta what? Rip the th fangs out? It's destroying it. But you gotta be very careful with the venom gland and the Okay, it sounds like you know how to do it, so just do it. Snap the teeth. Out of the I guess it wasn't a staring contest. Trust each other <laughs> and never blink. You trusted me. Meaning we didn't doubt you. Trust each other, don't doubt each other is what I really meant. Beat his ass! 
Barry, Barry, the main block! Uppercut. Damn. Bro, Spencer's gonna be so depressed once he leaves the game and he's not gonna be able to do any of this anymore. Bro, honestly, he might just stay in here. Like, bro, I had a better life in the game than I did in real life. I'm staying here. I would not be shocked. Hello, Doctor. Been a long time. I don't even know who you are. We just want to go home. Ooh! Who threw that? Oh, it's Nick Jonas. That's Nick Jonas. That's him. That's him. I need you to follow me and do exactly as I say. Let's mm -hmm. move. It's like, yeah, that's totally. That's against the wall. Ooh, damn. Oh. You couldn't have told us that ahead of time. Wait, are you the pilot? Seaplane somebody? Yes. Yeah, that's me. Wait a minute, wait, you're the, you're the other character that was taken. And he's the guy from the, the very beginning of the movie. I wonder how many lives he has then, if he still has all three or he's on his last one. You're a girl. Woman. <laughs> Real life, you probably want to hit that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this movie is PG-13, so like, yeah, it's not meant for kids. I assumed it was. It won't happen again. So I'm gonna kill you. Damn. Damn, this is a nice little crib you got here. It's Alan Parrish. Mm. Wait, you mean other people have been stuck here too? Yeah, I mean, this is Alan Parrish's house. I'm just living in it. First time, my hot air balloon wouldn't even take off. And then there was the whole plane thing I mentioned. And once I got down to my last life. Yeah, I just, I'm not risking it. Dude, Nick Jonas is a way better actor than I thought. What the hell? I'm with a margarita. You sure can't. You need a zoologist for that. Yep, you need you need the four other characters to to get out. You know the game, and and between us, we have a lot of strengths. Yeah, mm. we're actually pretty good together. Mm-hmm. I don't. You're our missing piece. You were the thing that we needed to find. Yep. Dudes, let's do this. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see the statue, which is weird because it's like the most important thing in Jumanji, and it's huge. You gotta advance in the game more, and then it will it will reveal itself. It's usually how games go. Last time I just waited till they left. How long did that take? Three weeks. Oh, fuck. Maybe there's another door somewhere, but we gotta distract those guys first. No, 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 no. What you gotta do is you gotta wait till they're not looking at you and then you run right past them. Boom, that's what you do. It's hard to do that when you don't have a mini map and you can't see which way they're looking based on the mini map, you know? Soldiers, I don't even know. I know, girl, but right now we don't have a better idea. You don't understand. I actually can't do it. I'm terrible at it. I can give you some pointers. Bethany would be perfect for that, but she has Jack Black's character, so. You don't think I can, Spencer? I'm not, like, I'm not actually some badass girl. What are you talking about? You're talking. Guess you are. You could do anything. He doesn't know the shit. <laughs> Show me how it's done. Class is in session. <laughs> See, Jack Black does a really good job. <laughs> Uh, portraying Bethany. <laughs> Which way you play it depends on what kind of guy you're dealing with. This is like my dream and my nightmare all at one time. Yeah, it's like super overwhelming hearing this for the first time. Good, that's yeah. better. Now smile, you look terrified. Okay, since they're like just NPCs, they're probably just gonna respond to anything she does. Cause I mean, it technically it's scripted, right? Like it's supposed to happen. You basically just go, or, or her character is just automatically going to do it. Like how Kevin Hart's character automatically spits out facts. It's something like that's going to happen. Like some script is going to kick in. To bomb. Cindy Crawford. That's your go-to? I'm just saying. I'm sure they'd like to get Jiggy with her. Yeah, his age is showing. Because <laughs> they don't know he's from 1996. What year do you think it is? Yeah. What do you mean? Oh, no. It's 1996. <sighs> he's been... In... You're Alex Freak, aren't you? Mm. Yeah, that's right. Wait, wait, you mean Freak House? Wait, what are you, what are you yeah. guys talking about? His dad pressed Spencer earlier in the movie, yeah. I don't exactly know how to tell you. You've been in this game for 20 years. That's probably oh. not how I would have done it. You guys are messing with me, right? No, we're not. Alex Freak, everybody in Brantford knows about you. Damn. You're the kid that disappeared. Wait, so when he comes out of the game, is he gonna... Is he, is he gonna be the same age as when he went into the game, or is he gonna come out 20 years older? Hello, little lady. What are you doing out here all alone? 
Bro, these guys look like John C. Riley. <laughs> She's forgotten all of our training. Let's go. Yeah, it's too much at once. Like, like Bethany has been doing this for so much longer. It's it's natural to Bethany now, but to someone who's never done this, it's like it's an overwhelming amount of information to remember. Hello, little lady. What are you doing out here? Yeah, just keep this going over and over and over. You are a badass. Oh. Oh, oh, okay. You're supposed to kill me, man, because the song just kicked in. You guys like to dance? Oh, you just dance with them. That's right. But you kill, like, the killer dance or whatever. So you're going to take them out by dancing with them. Yeah, dancing is her strength, so that's the script. Her strength is dance fighting. Mm, dance fighting, yeah. The helicopter, we got to told you. I don't know. I you just gave us away. Oh, she's yes. yes. Oh my God, these guys are so annoying. Girlfriend, oh my God, you did it! Did. Yeah, give me a hug, girlfriend. That's great. <laughs> That's so awkward. I can't do it. Okay, I told you I'm not a good pilot. Maybe we should take the school bus. But no, you have to no. Damn bus! You picked the plane in the hot air balloon. Maybe you were supposed to pick the helicopter. No, I can't do it. Okay, I don't want to die. Uh. Yeah, he can't. He doesn't want to risk it. I'll do it. Oh. How hard can it be? It's a helicopter. You, you press a button. The, uh... Yeah, it's literally just a boom, boom, boom. That's it. It's it's not that hard. It's not that hard. It's, I just gotta get. Cause ain't got no step stool. So let me see something. Bro, you're not that short. If I can fight those guys, you can fly this helicopter. I know you can. Mm hmm Come on. It's in your script. Wait, we're just gonna take off in this shed without? Yeah, we gotta get the helicopter out of here first, and then I would. Oh, all right, shit. It's for... Yep. <gasps> What's wrong? Something's broken. What? Hang on. Okay, as long as he doesn't die, though. Be good. There's no way that's good news. No. Stampede. I remember that from the first movie. Hurry up! Bro, if anyone can do it, it's him. There's some mesh plates. Oh. Here's that rod thingy. Shh, connect, shh, connect. No, no, no. Got it! Oh, no, the gem! The gem just fell out. Oh, no. Oh, Kevin. Are you gonna say anything? Oh, what? Fuck. I dropped the jewel. You dropped the jewel? I leaned over, thought I had to puke, and I didn't. And it came on my backpack. We need the freaking jewel! I know. That's 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 the crazy part, because I know we need it. So <laughs> I feel like Kevin Hart is like improvising <laughs> like most of his lines this in this movie. This is just Kevin Hart's personality. There! I see it! Right in the middle of the rhinos. How are we gonna do this? You gotta go get it, right, buddy? You gotta send Spencer out there. He's the best character for this job. Spencer's not the best personality to do it, but he has the best character, so. Why, why did you show Kevin, right? Is he about to sacrifice Kevin? Sorry, for what? Mm. Distract them. I guess you have to. Okay, but if he respawns in this Grand Canyon, he's just gonna get killed again. Unless we could swoop him hell quick. Alex, get ready to roll us to the side. What? No, imagine he falls from the sky and just gets fucking just gets chopped in half by the helicopter blades. In the helicopter blades. Oh my god. <gasps> Wait, he's allergic to mosquitoes. No, he's gonna die. He's gonna die. He's gonna, he's gonna die. He's gonna die. Oh, Alex. Alex, no. No, we're gonna revive him. We're gonna revive him. Bethany, stop. Your tattoo. It looks like you're giving him one of your lives. Yeah, oh, okay. We can transfer it. I'm okay with that. You have to. You need it for yourself. <laughs> I want Alex to come home too. Okay, okay. That's very selfless of you, Bethany. It's very selfless. That's character development right there. I like that. I like that a lot. It's kind of just because she thinks that Nick Jonas here is hot. So she wants him to come home. What? What are you looking at? You got a situation. <gasps> He's hard. No! <laughs> oh my god, these things are crazy! <laughs> 20 years, huh? I really like the character development for 
Bethany and Martha in this because they were not very likable in the very beginning. They're coming around. I, I, I like their characters now. But also, I think it has a lot to do with Jack Black and the actress that's playing Martha. I don't know her name, so I apologize. But they're both doing a phenomenal job in this so far. Thanks. I feel like ever since I lost my phone, my other senses have kind of heightened. Yeah, it's crazy how that happens. Does phone mean something different in the future? Oh, yeah, he's from 96. He has no idea. Dude, imagine you just show him an iPhone. You show him, like, an iPhone 12. He's going to be tripping. Hey. What are you doing? I, uh, I was just filming these up. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they like each other, but they're both super awkward. I like you, Martha. I like... Like, I'm fully into you. I'm a nerd! <laughs> They're gonna kiss. They're just gonna kiss. And it's gonna be the most awkward kiss ever, though. Oh! <laughs> Oh, what the fuck? Oh my, what the fuck was that? Bro, why did you stick your tongue out like that? <laughs> Are you down here professing your love for one another? I found a Jaguar. Oh, you did? No, it can't be that easy. Never is. It's a trap. Yeah, some bullshit's gonna happen if you follow this path. When you see the elephant begin the climb, Oh, uh, we gotta start climbing now, I guess. In the trees? That's how we're gonna get it across. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god, wait, what? Oh, oh, he just died. Oh. Okay, these jaguars could definitely kill all of us. And we only have, a lot of us only have one life left, so. I think so. You still have the jewel, right? Yeah. Oh, thank god. I can't do this. Actually, brave. Spencer, I just saw you hanging out of a helicopter. It's a lot easier to be brave when you have lives to spare. A lot harder when you only have one life. Yeah, this is... Well, he only has one life left, too. That's all we get. That's how it works. Mm-hmm. The question is, is how are you going to live it? Exactly. This relates to real life, too. We can do this, man. We can do it together. Okay, look, at the same time, too, if you don't make this risk, you're never going to get out of the game anyway. You're going to be stuck here for the rest of your life then. So, like Alex, he's been here for 20 years. You're going to get out or you're going to die trying. And you just have to come to terms with that. I don't know video games, but what I do know is football. Those oh, 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 what's our game plan, coach? What's our game plan? Run one hell of an offense. You guys. <laughs> All right, we're running forwards right now. That's our go-to, forwards. <laughs> If you know, you know. I'm gonna fan out and run the play that I call the double reverse refrigerator. Oh, double reverse. Oh. Get to the statue. Go. Okay. Stay calm. Don't panic. Move. Oh. You can control it. Take me instead. Okay. Mm, no. Because I don't have it. Mm. Kevin has it. That's right. And he's calming right now. Yeah. Why would you bring it out of the backpack? <laughs> yeah, why would you just have it in your hand exposed like that? Like that? Come on, Kevin. Elephant. Begin the climb. Ooh. Hell no, I couldn't do it. Hell no. Hell no. Just be tipping to it. <laughs> Alright, now sprint out of there. Who cares if you step on it? You just sprint. Oh. Sprint. Go, 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 go. Don't waste any time. Just go. I'll take that. Uh, no, you won't. That is my weakness. Mm. Oh, yeah, because she. Oh, yeah, she'll disappear with the jewel. That's right. Okay. Smart. Yep, and he's gonna catch her falling from the sky. So she can meet him up there right away. He could just basically glitch her way up there. Jumanji! I think we did it. I think we won. I think we did it. Guys, it's Nigel. Yep, you won. Well done, intrepid adventurers. You lifted the curse. So sadly, this is where we part. Adieu, Professor Oberon. Okay, are any of them gonna stay? 
I feel like Spencer might want to stay because his life, like I was saying earlier, his life in here is so much better. Maybe, yeah, maybe Spencer and Martha stay in here. Roundhouse. Wait. Hmm? What if we didn't go back? Yeah, exactly. I just... Let's blow up their lives in here. It'll be so much better. I like being like this. Hmm? With you. Then let's be like this. Every day. Well, it'd be really hard for Spencer because, you know, he's not 6'6", 270 pounds, so... Oh. Is Spencer gonna leave though? I'm ready to go home. Yeah, actually, okay, also, let's see how old Alex is in real life now, see if he ages at all. Where's Alex? Yeah, Alex isn't at the school. He's at his house because that's, that's where he got sucked in. Wait, look. Oh, the house is restored. That's Alex right there. So he did age. Damn. Wait, who is that? That actor looks so familiar. You made it back. Yeah, I did. It spit me out right where I started. So, mm -hmm. 1996. Oh, okay. So it spit him out in the year. That's why the house isn't wrecked. Well, then that's why he has a family and everything. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. My daughter's name is Bethany. Oh, I named it after. Oh, we named her after the girl. Damn. In my life. So he's been waiting for them for twenty f years. Holy shit! You want to go backpacking, like in nature? Yeah, but she's a totally different person now. Oh, um, I'll catch you later. I'll see you after class. <laughs> Have you guys talked to Martha? Oh, I was texting her this weekend. She didn't switch up on them or anything. I respect it. Go get that girl, Doctor Bravestone. <laughs> be dr bravestone right now you're still him what let's kiss this shit yep oh okay wow that yeah that's not super duper awkward okay okay oh the music wait what the wait what's going on oh oh uh, that's why the bowling ball is there all right, that was Jumanji. Welcome to the jungle. All right, I'm gonna be honest. This movie was way better than I thought it was gonna be. This movie blew me away as far as expectations. Holy shit. This movie was way funnier than I thought it was gonna be. Well, I kind of assume since the first Jumanji is PG. So yeah, you could show it to kids and everything. And like what I remember from that movie is it was pretty kid friendly, except when they're trying to get away from some of the things. Like as a little kid watching that, it was kind of terrifying, but I'm sure if I watched it now, it'd be totally fine. I assumed this movie was going to be like rated PG slash E. Like, no, dude, they were kind of wild with the jokes in this. <laughs> kind of shocked by some of the jokes they went for in this, to be honest. But they were executed really well. So they, they didn't feel forced or anything. Like nothing in this movie really felt forced. And what I really like is they didn't try and just copy the first movie. They did its own thing, but they acknowledged the last movie in little ways. Like, okay, like Nick Jonas's hut he's living in, that was Rob. Robin Williams' hut from the first movie. Now, okay, as I was watching it, I didn't recognize the name because it's been a very long time since I've seen Jumanji, the first Jumanji. And again, the reason why I skipped it is because I figured if I were to watch it again, I would just remember everything as it's happening. So that's why I decided to jump over. But we could definitely do a rewatch if you guys want me to. I know I just said like I don't remember much from the first movie, but I can confidently say this movie definitely has its own identity apart from the first movie, which I really appreciate. This is one of the best sequels I've seen in a very long time like i i i'm pretty mind blown by how good this actually was i think every single actor and actress portrayed their roles perfectly nothing felt forced by any of them like they all did such a phenomenal job i'm shocked like especially jack black portraying as a teenage girl that was hilarious that was so good i haven't seen jack black in a movie in such a long time i, I remember seeing a lot of jack like older jack black movies like king kong i've seen that quite a few times as a kid and then, like kung fu panda i've seen that so i haven't seen the second kung fu panda though only the first one i think and like year one like that's such a random such a random jack black movie dude. year one if you know you know <laughs> like with like michael Sarah, and actually um 
McLovin's in it too. Like that's that's such a random movie. <laughs> like Nacho Libre too. I've seen that. And School of Rock. I've seen that too. But those are like the last Jack Black movies I've seen. So like it's been a very long time since I've seen him in a movie, and, and he's still pretty damn funny. So and then like okay, honestly though, Spencer as the Rock felt kind of gimmicky at first. Like it felt kind that felt kind of forced and unnatural. But then as the movie went on, it definitely started to feel a lot better. So only like the first quarter of the Rock in this movie felt kind of weird. But then at halfway through the Rock's performance, and then it's started to feel way better and then kevin hart kevin hart's just kevin hart dude he's hilarious i feel like yeah i feel like kevin hart was just like improvising a lot of his lines in this like i feel like that's how kevin hart would actually be in this situation <laughs> and then the actress that plays martha karen gillen she did a great job in this too i i enjoyed her performance a lot and then nick jonas too nick jonas really really surprised me i'm not saying this is like the best performance i've ever seen by an actor the only movie i've seen him in is like camp rock you know camp rock one and two those are the only other movies i've seen with nick jonas i'm like yeah okay but honestly i kind of wish they didn't make it out of this movie like maybe they got maybe a couple of them got stuck in there and then that would have been a really good reason for them to go back in the next movie because I'd be really interested to see them going back and saving them. Technically, since these are just the characters, we could have a brand new cast next movie, all brand new personalities playing the same characters again. So every single Jumanji character, actor, would have to portray a totally different personality, which, which would actually be pretty interesting to see, honestly. But anyways, that was Jumanji. Welcome to the jungle. Comment down below what you thought about this movie, down below in the comments. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.